This is Bompai, a village in a farm plain district. Here, the trees are being cut at an alarming rate to produce charcoal. I'm in this business for 10 years today. I do cut 10 trees a day. And after burning these 10 trees, I get 500 Ghana cities. I chew from the NGO Relief International is taking an interesting approach to tackling this problem. Relief International, since the inception of this project, have been working to create a market for cook stoves in Ghana. This project is contributing its quota to global climate change through the avoidance of deforestation in Ghana. Over the last 10 years, Relief International has helped local enterprises here in Accra manufacture and sell more efficient cook stoves. Called Japan, these stoves use only half the charcoal of traditional stoves. To date, more than half a million Japan stoves have been sold. This is reducing deforestation and is also cutting carbon emissions. And on the ground here in Ghana, it creates employment and is saving families money on their fuel bills. My name is Addison and I produce liners for the Japa project. Uh, Japa has provided employment for me and my family for about eight years now and I work with two people in addition to myself. All Japa stoves are made locally. Both the liners and the metal stove bodies and metal is recycled from scrap material. This project helps local manufacturers develop their skills and provides sustainable long-term employment. Well, we started this project about 10 years ago, but I think we made a, a very significant progress because this was a new thing. We had to train people. We had to organize, we had to look for the best materials and so on. The Japa project provides working capital to help small businesses like Ekems increase their production and supply growing market demand. It's a very good business to say because it has helped me a lot in so many ways. That is the one I used to pay my family, used to take care of myself and the other workers I'm working with. RI came in to help us a lot through spray machine, through loans, to expand the business. So far, what we see is what the RI help us to grow the business up to. This is Kokompe. At Kokompe, all kinds of scrap material, including the scrap metal used to produce Japa, is found. We manufacture about 2,700 stuff in a month. Our children are now in their university through this work. Over the last decade, the project has supported stove manufacturers, providing knowledge, research, and funding to allow the consistent, high quality production of efficient Japan stoves. But investment does not stop there. Relief International drives demand for Japan stoves through branding and marketing. As a result, Japa is now a household name in Ghana. The project has also developed a national network of 500 retail partners, providing further employment. Retailers receive marketing training, tools, and support to help them sell Japa cookstoves. Japa has helped me a lot for taking care of my children. Even a single mother, I was able to pay my children's school fees, uh, feeding, and everything in my home. And Japa has helped me to open another big shops at another places. Similarly, stove users also make some savings on the amount of charcoal they use every day to cook. My name is Aisha Salasa. I'm a police officer. I work at Madina Police Station. You can cook a lot of food without wasting much charcoal. 
it doesn't spread ashes. The woman you found, all the ashes enter into the down dish and to stay there till you finish your cooking. Then you upload it. That's one good thing about Japa, and that's why I like it very much. I've used the Japa cocoa for seven years now. I'm in a family house, we have plenty. We don't buy outside food, we always cook three times a day with a Japa and save some money to pay your light bills and then other utility bills. I used Japa cocoa for 11 years. I used my restaurant, and it saved me. So, retailers and consumers alike now recognize the Japa stove as a quality, affordable product that provides safe, fast, and convenient cooking. 2.4 million people now benefit from Japa stoves and have saved more than 41 million US dollars on the cost of charcoal money they can use for sending their children to school, meeting health care costs, and investing in a more secure future. This reduction in the use of charcoal also means a substantial reduction in carbon emissions. This project has already saved a staggering 1 million tons of carbon dioxide. That is the same as taking more than 200,000 vehicles off the road for a year. Working with Climate Care, Relief International is able to turn this carbon dioxide savings into income, which is used to sustain and grow the Japa project. At Climate Care, we help businesses all over the world support this innovative project, paying for carbon reductions for their own unavoidable emissions. These businesses are helping to tackle global climate change and also to improve lives here in Ghana. We at Relief International are delighted to be working with Climate Care and its business partners all over the world by making this project a reality. You can support the Japa project by offsetting your own emissions with Climate Care. By demanding Japa credits, you will help tackle climate change and you will invest in a truly sustainable project, a project that has proved itself over 10 years. Your investment will ensure the Japa project continues to provide real improvements for the people of Ghana and their local environment. <laughs>